Hi guys, how are you guys doing today? And we're gonna have a great video today. So, I'm gonna start a playlist called NBA Update and Updates. And I am gonna tell you all the way to the updates from whatever team. From the Lakers, to the Clippers, to the Warriors, to whatever NBA team, just comment down below and I'll tell you what team. But today, we're going to talk about my favorite team, um, the Los Angeles Lakers. I have LeBron um, behind me right now. I'm watching SportsCenter, so that's why you hear that. But... Yeah, so, um, today we're going to talk about Avery Bradley and how he opted out of the Lakers option. So, basically, his son, if you didn't hear, his son was ill of, um, in the past, according to Brian Winhorse, he said that, um, he opted out because his son was ill and he wanted to just keep his family safe and stuff, and I, um, also, and I, ex and I, I know that's a good reason. I just think that now they're deeper, and now the Lakers want to sign J.R. Smith. And I don't think that's a good idea at all. I mean, at all. And J.R.'s a really great guard. He just hasn't played in two years, so I don't know how he would do. That's the only problem, because if... If he plays good the first two games, like if he scores 20 plus, we're good. Or 15 plus, we're good. We just need a guard because, like, Alex Caruso, he can still steal the ball because he's in top five. But Avery Bradley, even though he only scored eight points a game, like, still, he, he was a really great guard for us. And now that we don't have Avery Bradley, like Alex Caruso, or we'll have to sign J.R. Smith. But, yeah. And I'm going to have, um, so we're talking about the NBA right now. We're going to have ML, um, MLB, we're going to have NBA, NFL, I already have that playlist. We're going to have MLB, and we're going to have MLS. So, you'll probably see an MLS video come out soon. Um, I'm going to be gone in Georgia, but I'll try to get you guys some videos out. So you guys can watch them. So, um, yeah. And MLS will probably be our next video. Now, the time I'm recording, the time that I'm recording this, it'll be out like tomorrow. So, um, yeah. But yeah, so I think the Lakers are taking a big drop. Now, I think Alex Caruso could still get some points because he's really young and he can still score because he's a young athletic guard. Um, but I don't know. I think it's a big drop-off, though, of what they had before Avery Bradley opted out. I don't know. Um, tomorrow, um, next NBA update video, um, I'm going to talk about Davis Bertans and his situation with the Wizards and then Trevor Ariza. So I'm basically talking about the guys that opted out in COVID-19 plus reviews that tested positive. And then I'm going to talk about the scenario of the standings. So now this is the part of, now, okay, this is the last part. I mainly talked about Avery Bradley the most of the video, but this is the standing part. So I think that the Lakers are going to at least go to the West Conference Finals. I think they could win a championship, and I'm not even being biased, but AD and LeBron, like, who can stop that? Now, Kawhi and PG is a really good duo. And that's the only team I think we would run into or the Milwaukee Bucks in the finals. I think those are the only two teams that we would run into that wouldn't give us, like, that would give us a hard time. I think that's the only two teams. Because, like, okay, like the Suns. I don't know why... 
like the NBA invited them. If they somehow made the playoffs, we would blow them out probably. But I just think the Bucks and the Clippers are the only two teams we should be um, feared of, or not feared of, but we we actually have a challenge. So I hope you guys like this video. Um, and I almost forgot, if you like this video and you want to watch more, um, you can subscribe, hit that bell button, and hit that like button for more NBA, MLB, NFL, and MLS videos. And also hit that big thumbs up if you like this video. And see you guys in the next one. Peace out.